Jeez Louise, man. We've made a very sad place to be. Thinking about these two places <laughs> being next to each other, this is bad news, dude. But to be fair, still a great Tony Hawk level. Did we move Crick Garvin in? I think we should build up the street he lives on. We can build pretty much anything. I think we do need neighbors. Do they need walls? <laughs> uh, do we want to give them all a yum cooker? Everyone gets a bed. I think you're building my dream house. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, God. Oh. Uh Oh God, the basement. Okay. Oh, dude, I don't think this place should have a basement. Oh, we're not having a basement, friendo. Let me tell that, you something. That, that even violates some of my ethics. <laughs> okay, there's the weird rooms where people can do their thing. There's the place where people <laughs> sleep. 14 rooms here on the bottom floor. Although granted, we could just make eight Sims live here and then have them host parties all the time. And then maybe people would just crash on the extra beds. That's true. Because it's a hostel, not a prison. It's a fun place to be. <laughs> Again, we need a pool table down here for sure, for sure. Because that reminds you that you are sometimes free to leave. I will see what I have in the fun section of the thing. Okay. Put a middle island that's also a bar. Oh, hell f yeah, dude. Like, we're getting the best bar. The way that I like to say is arranged like a prison, designed like a party house. Huh. It's a great new saying that people will say. I don't think it's a thing that people will say ever. Can I be honest with you about something? <laughs> oh, God. Okay, there we go. <laughs> so we've got these two bars where people can be served. Can we put stools in the... Oh, hell yeah, dude. See? Not so horrible anymore. This is it, dude. At the edge of each of the things, you could put either a stove or a fridge or like a jukebox. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and put a jukebox. Like, you you know we're going to have at least one of these bad boys. I need to find out where we have fun. <laughs> in um, the rooms, of course. In the rooms, of course. Okay, here we go. Uh, activities and skills? You know it's going to be great when in The Sims somebody goes, okay, here we go. <laughs> you asked for a pool table, and I'm not sure what I can provide on that front. Or, like, ping pong table. Just, like, a generic, like something you would see at a rec room. What the hell? <laughs> Well, you said something you would see in a rec room, and I thought maybe this jungle gym like would be what you're looking like for. Like a f rocket ship. It's a jungle gym. Yeah, well, it's a jungle gym that could be featured on the next series of Star Trek. We could use the look at me monkey bars. What about a box of kindness? Would that do it? I don't even know what that is. Yeah, I don't know either. Okay, what the hell do we put in here? Is there seriously not a pool table? I think that would be like the second item they made. Like before they made people, they should put pool tables in this game. I Can you search? <laughs> search. There's a search bar. Type in pool. Mm, game table. Uh, table. Well, that's too vague. I don't know, man. I don't know what to say. You gotta be kidding. Ping pong? Oh gosh. Uh, uh foosball. How do you they foosball? feel about chess? It's what all the cool drunk kids do is they play goddamn chess. I can't it's help a... you. Okay, let's throw some chess tables in. I, I can't help you <laughs> with any of this. What if they get liquored up and then someone plays the cool piano? And so while somebody else tries to play something on the jukebox. Yeah. <laughs> One guy's trying to play Claire de Lune and the other guy's trying to play the 97th remix of Old Town Road. <laughs> I don't know, man. I'm sorry. I don't know what to tell you. I don't know why there's no pool table. What's the table two to the right of the guitar? The, it's a woodworking table. <laughs> <laughs> well, they have a woodworking table, but they don't have America's... <laughs> sure. Sure. <laughs> they have a woodworking table, but not America's pastime. <laughs> I say that America has many pastimes. Yeah, I'm pretty sure baseball is what you're thinking of. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what we'll do is we'll put a giant TV. Uh, excuse me, could you open that menu back up? I'm pretty sure there was a penguin TV that you ignored. <laughs> it's small. It's a children's. Put it television. under the big one. All right, hold on. God damn it. <laughs> Is this good for you? Yes. I'm almost there. <laughs> Gross. 
All right, and then we'll get a chair to match. Uh, uh, mm, excuse me. There's a chair with a bear. It's the bear chair. I can't bear if you don't put the bear chair there. Okay. Oh, couches, dude. <laughs> yes. Yes. More. <laughs> yes. Good. Good. <laughs> So you're, we basically have a theater. Oh, E is the eyedropper tool. Man, I'm learning so much about The Sims. I'm learning so much about my sense of interior decorating. Um, okay. What hell have we brought? The best hell. What is this? What is this, though? <laughs> For God's sake. I'm so pleased with this. God, it's so scary. It looks like the bears are just watching TV. <laughs> and it looks like the penguins are instructing their bear army. You just gotta feel like you're embraced by the warm hug of a bear while somebody's sawdust from the woodworking table drifts by your ear. Jesus Christ. Okay, um, I forgot a front door. You could put two front doors, yeah, one on either side yeah, of the TV. Yeah, yeah. Just like a movie symmetrical. theater. Oh, you yeah, like you're a movie right. theater where you come up the sides. Oh, for God's sake. They have a king's door and a queen's door? The Sims! Come on. We're socially progressive. There's a rainbow door. Rainbow also, front door. Oh, hold on. Do we want that to be on the outside or the inside? I like how they're only progressive on one side. It's like companies during and not during Pride Month. <laughs> yeah, exactly. All of June. <laughs> then all of a sudden July hits and they're like, yeah, I don't know what you're talking about, actually. You can still see the bears poke over a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> then it's like, hey. <laughs> <laughs> oh man that's so much better than i expected it would be to start listen this is horrible but it's a good start shall we give them somewhere to do their business i mean we give them two places to do some of their business but are you talking about like an office or like a poop place like a poop place for god's <laughs> <laughs> for good all right here we go i'm i'm doing it you take the reins on this one Oh. On, the, on the reins on Trouble in Toilet Town. Well, we could make it so that everyone has their own bathroom and it relates to <laughs> where their room is down here. What if, like, the trick of this house is that when you walk in, people are like, oh, God, there's, okay, there's all these bear chairs and a woodworking table. I don't want to stay at this hostel. But then... I don't agree with this fiction. Nobody would be upset by the bear chairs. Uh, ev I think most people would be upset by the bear chairs. Leave a comment below if you would enjoy the bear chairs. <laughs> <laughs> yep, just go ahead and comment below for sure. Here's something that I want to work on. And it's going to take some time and some patience, but we're going to see what happens. So join us on our 24-hour live stream. What are you doing? <laughs> oh, dear God. How deep does that oh, go? Oh, it, go it goes all the way. 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 Okay. That won't work. That won't work. That won't work. I'm so sorry. We paid contractors so much money <laughs> to build... <laughs> to build a goddamn bar <laughs> and then you just pay another contractor and go i just want you to destroy everything between zone a1 to d4 just shut it all down hold up are you making a third floor of this house just for a pool are you questioning me <laughs> No. No, exactly. Wait, hold up. Hold up. Hold up. If I remember correctly, we were making a poop place. Do you want them to poop and dip? Absolutely. <laughs> no, absolutely not. Because that... you know if they poop there, they'd have to scoop. And we haven't provided scooping supplies. Oh, I see. I see. I see. I have to give walls here. Okay. Oh, uh, people right. have to live inside walls now. Ugh, human rights. Ugh, <laughs> overrated. I want to leave at least one, two, three, the others, four, just five. one block. Oh, God. No, 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 no. Don't go all the way out. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, Lord. Can you one... imagine a contractor who, like, accidentally builds a wall and goes, oh, God, oh no. Oh, oh Lord. Oh, nobody oh. asked me to build this. Ah, uh, even I didn't want to build this wall. Ah, uh. I do like the idea the, uh, that he looks to his lackeys and he's like, you guys got this for the day, right? And they're like, yeah, I'm pretty sure we understand the uh, the instructions. And he gets back and he's like, the f*** is this? No one asked for this wall. To remind you, there has to be a bathroom here somewhere. 
This is the bathroom floor, Darren. Th so they can just poop in the corner? Oh my goodness. Would you just be patient? I'm trying to get two things done at once, son. <laughs> no, it's an internet series. I have to be high energy and, <laughs> and comedic. Your comedic ass can wait a goddamn minute while I figure out my sh**. Just jump cut me to when you're done. I'm gonna go to bed. <laughs> <laughs> you. You're gonna love it. <laughs> okay, they're all gonna have a sink. Lovely. Who doesn't love a good sink? I am neutral on the topic of good sinks. They're all gonna have like a nice little turlet. It's gonna be a good toilet. You remember in, in 300 where he kicks the guy into that pit? Can we just make that kind of pit and everybody just sort of bends over and kind of communally poops in a circle? We absolutely can't do that. No. This game is very limiting. Listen, we could, but I don't I don't think it would work, really. I don't think they'll poop there. What's the newest Sims? Four, five, seven? This is the newest one. Well, whenever Sims 5 comes out, we should petition the developers to add... A poop hole. A poop crevice. <laughs> you would like there to be a poop hole in all... Oh, for God's sake. That's actually, I think, I think that's the number one bug fix that I really want them to, to do. <laughs> What do we think of this as a bathroom? This is a good bathroom, right? You get all your essentials. <laughs> I like that you can still see the drywall. <laughs> yeah. Well, we haven't painted anything yet, it, it so... Just screams, it just screams, just wait for the water damage. <laughs> <laughs> Boom. Here for the sh**. Boom. Maybe. <laughs> is that an intentional pun? Uh, I, I guess it was. Oh, no, hold on. I'm gonna mess this up no. real bad. You are gonna mess this up. Remember when I said we were OCD friendly and you left a single goddamn box? There we go. Oh, we go. go, no. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I promise everything's gonna be okay, everyone. And just remember, kids, in one of these toilets is buried treasure. And if you go searching and you dig hard enough, you will find the legend of Curly's gold. Oh, please, for the love of goodness gracious, don't go digging around in the hostel toilets. <laughs> Be safe, children. <laughs> All right, so. This also gives them a place to change for the pool, so it really works. Oh, it's going to be flawless. Don't get it twisted. DJ, I think the whole point of our friendship is that we're both deeply flawed humans. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll start with that, and then where does that leave us? We want this to be bigger. We want it to be at least this big. We could probably get it even wider, right? Realistically, at no point in time have we said that we want the people living here to be comfortable. Well, no, we haven't. <laughs> that's a reasonable pool size, yes? I think so. Yeah. I think that that's a... Oh, hell yeah, dude. Can you make all the walls glass so when you're pooping you can watch someone swim? Oh. My <laughs> god. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Windows. Big, big windows. Big windows. Big windows. Yes. We've made it the right size so far. Oh, no. What are you doing to me? Three. Ooh, I'm going to need that extra lamp. Okay. Listen, we have to make a decision. Huh? Just Wait, no, we don't. No, we don't. No, we don't. To... I got it. I got it. I got it. Oh, hell yeah. This window is called Let There Be More Light. <laughs> It really lets the place feel a little bit more... Um, Terrifying? Uh, it feels like you're in a shark cage. <laughs> I like the idea of, see, when you're pooping, you can watch people swim, but when you're swimming, you can watch people poop. <laughs> <laughs> well, listen, that isn't actually the case. Unless, no, that's unless, totally unless, the case. You unless, lined up all the unless. toilets with all the... Oh, my God! <laughs> <laughs> unless... Now, this is a question that maybe we're not equipped to handle on this particular show, but do Sims have consciences? I don't think they do. Do they Do they understand the moral ambiguity of what's going on here? Do we need to do this so that they can see out the windows? Is that what we need to do? I think, I think we might need to, yeah. Okay, yeah, this will go great. That, that last oh, no. bathroom. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. <laughs> Well, we've made some choices. Why are we so obsessed with making sure people know what they're doing in the bathroom? I don't know. That one wasn't me. I know, but it's just the way it ended I up, I need to Darren. stress that you did that one. This is not nothing. It's not much, but it's I not have nothing. A, I have an idea. At the end of the hallway, the bathroom hallway, put a door so they can step out onto the lower roof. Okay, okay, that's an idea. 
I'm hearing your idea. I'm appreciating it. That sounds like you're thoughtfully throwing it in the trash. I'm not throwing it in the trash. I do promise that. I really need to know if by Catholic dogma, if what we're making is officially a sin or just in essence. I think they're going to write an 11th commandment just to tell people not to build what we're building. (laughs) What do we need? Tiles? Where are you? Where are you, Tiles? There you are. This should do the trick, right? Does this work for us? Uh, That does. The outer, I'm not sure what to do with the non-pool edge. Yes. I don't like that. Mm, You're going to learn to love it. (laughs) Only if you also add doors next to the stairs, which let you go through the bathroom. So you have two ways. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Don't even worry. That's the plan. Ain't nobody wants to get to a second floor deck by going up two floors and then down a floor. That's a stupid house plan. Who would make a house that ridiculous? I mean, us, but <laughs> not a, not us. We're we're good, smart people. Not I. Not really I. understand interior decorating and design. You think we should we should make a rip off of the Property Brothers where we <laughs> demolish and remodel houses? I think we should avoid that at all costs for the sake. Oh of- my God! Can you can you imagine what was it? Extreme Extreme Makeover Home Edition. So it's like. Like, we we fixed your house. <laughs> they come back. It's like this now cost eighty million dollars, and and your property tax is gonna bankrupt you in about six weeks. But <laughs> God, look at the size of those toilets. <laughs> but you're gonna love these toilets. Pool railing. Let's leave the bathrooms with the drywall. We've all made poor choices. <laughs> Tiki bar. <laughs> just, just put Santa back. What's that back there? Unimportant. Is there a disco ball? I mean, it's worth looking, right? Oh, God! Darren! 